A Fort Lauderdale officer with access to children has been arrested for allegedly engaging in online sex chats with a person he believed to be a minor. Local 10's Roy Ramos is live with the disturbing details on this. Roy. Louis, disturbing to say the least. We do know that he has been arrested and has been brought right here to the Broward County Jail, where he is now in the process of being booked. In fact, we are still working to get his mug shot, but we can tell you he's been identified as 29-year-old Louis James Walsh, and he was arrested this afternoon after detectives received some information from the Minnesota Human Trafficking Investigators Task Force that Walsh was engaging in online chats with who he believed was a minor. Investigators said on at least two occasions, Walsh engaged in sexual conversations and sent nude pictures of himself to an undercover detective who he believed was an underage girl. Now, we did learn that Walsh works security detail at Cardinal Gibbons High School and St. Anthony Catholic School. Detectives also say he is a wrestling coach at Cardinal Gibbons. Now, we did reach out to Fort Lauderdale Police who released this statement that reads, in its entirety, this is a difficult situation for everyone involved. The Fort Lauderdale Police Department is shocked and disappointed to learn of the arrest of one of our officers. After an investigation by the Broward Sheriff's Office, Lewis Walsh was taken into custody on Wednesday. The details surrounding these allegations are very difficult to hear and do not reflect the character and professionalism expected of the men and women of this agency. Walsh has been placed on administrative leave without pay pending the outcome of a criminal investigation. This investigation will be handled by the Broward County Sheriff's Office and we encourage anyone who may feel victimized by this individual to immediately contact BSO. Now we also reached out to the Archdiocese of Miami who issued a statement that reads in part the safe environment office and the superintendent of schools encourage parents to review with their children the teaching boundaries safety lessons taught in Catholic schools and be aware of any suspicious activity on laptops cell phones iPads or desktops. As we come back out live to the Broward County Jail we can tell you that Walsh is now being charged with two counts of transmission of material harmful to a minor. As we mentioned before, he is still in the process of being booked. As soon as he is and as soon as we are able to obtain his mugshot, we'll be sure to bring it right back to you. For now, outside of the Broward County Jail here in Fort Lauderdale, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News. Roy, thank you. And